if it taps into a new piece of equipment sold by a Canadian company. The Ozomax Ozone Water System device was marketed at this week's Caribbean Water and Wastewater Association Conference here in Barbados. Sean Farrell reports. Could this be the technology Barbados is looking for to help it solve its water reuse and wastage problem? Alpha King certainly thinks his Ozomax Ozone Water System is the perfect answer for this and a whole range of related issues the country may have. This machine, which is by the Canadian company standards a small model, certainly impressed those gathered for a demonstration at the Bridgetown Sewage Treatment Plant yesterday. The company says it can convert 40,000 litres of wastewater to drinking water, but it's capable of building bigger machines for larger volumes. The water that people use, for example, in cooling towers, instead of dumping that out after it's chlorinated out for years and years, we can now recycle that water and save your water your water bill. Water is a scarce commodity and we need to preserve it. And I, I was happy to hear your ministers say that they, are, they recognize the need, the urgent need to do something about water. And this is the answer. Not, not chlorine, ozone. The Trinidadian-born businessman says the process destroys a wide range of bacteria, metals and dyes in water and can help save the country millions of dollars with the feces and so on from the homes and so on. Once it's ozonated and clean and we add the waste from the hotels, restaurants and so on, you can change that into a super soil and bag it and sell it to the farmers or give it to the farmers so you could increase your, your, growth, your food growth and stop importing food and do it right here in Barbados. It's obviously a new concept to Barbadians and may not readily whet the appetite of consumers of the precious resource. King believes, however, an adequate public relations campaign is all that's needed for the system to be accepted. Sean Farrell, CBC News. The fifth IDO Water Management Convention took place in Montego Bay, Jamaica. Several organizations from the Caribbean, South America and Jamaica participated in this convention, displaying their water-related technologies. Ozomax Global Marketing Inc., a Canadian company specializing in chemical-free technology for the world, also attended and demonstrated their easy to move and install portable wastewater unit. Food dye was added to a water sample and cleaned with ozone. Minutes later, the dye was successfully removed. This unit is ideal for resorts, hospitals, villages, and more. This unit, with the capacity of cleaning 40,000 gallons per day, generated most interest compared to other adjacent booth displays. The unit does not use any chemicals but cleans with ozone. For more